What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash the sub button to be notified for future readings. Um, these are free general collective readings for all signs, caps, and sag, everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply that flaw, everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate and leave the rest. Free general collective reading. Love and appreciate each and every one of you guys. We're at 13,258 subscribers. So if you think anyone else would like my channel, please feel free to share it very publicly via the word of mouth and social media. I very much appreciate it. I'm a single mom of two kids. So it really, really helps uh, support a single mom of two kids in one of her income streams. So I uh, very much appreciate it, you guys. Just saying. I received a channeling in. I wasn't, I told you guys earlier I wasn't going to do any more unless I got them. So I did. Um, so. Um, I'm going to do it. It's regarding a death. Um, so I think one of you guys is, um, I think one of you guys knows this person that's about to pass away and I'm just being serious or you're connected to them in some shape, form or fashion. Hopefully you can hear me. Okay. We've been having volume issues, so I've got to turn it all the way up. Okay. But yeah, I think one of you guys knows this person or you're connected to them or have been connected to them in some shape, form or fashion. And, um, You'll understand after I tell you the channeling, but I think it's a younger person. Thinks it's a masculine energy. I think he's younger. And I, um, you'll understand why once I deliver the channeling. But this is terrible. It's terrible. It's terrible. Um, but it's because of the choices he's about to make. And I'm just being serious about that. Um, it's really sad. Okay. So the channel message I received was um, a masculine is about to pass away soon through many, 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 many series of chain of events. Um, fraternal, fraternal order brother in a fraternity is what I heard. Fraternal order um, brother in a fraternity. Um, I heard it's going to shock many, many people. Alcohol poisoning um, is what I heard. It's going to cause a huge, 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 huge uproar in a community soon. That's what I just heard. It's going to cause a huge, huge, huge uproar in a community soon. So you plug it in how it resonates. Um, okay, so fraternal order, br brotherhood in a fraternity. So there's sororities and there's fraternities. Um, I look. I mean, after I received that channeling, I knew. I know what a fraternity is. I've never been in a sorority. Never would ever want to be in a sorority. I was in. I graduated like community college at like 30, and I'm 38. So. I didn't take that path because I, I didn't have that path to take. Uh, well, I did. Um, I went to college when I was 17 at UAH here in Huntsville. But I dropped out at first semester because I was way too young. I was 17. But my point is, this is terrible. This is terrible. I Even though I dropped out at 17, I just went to work um, to make some money. I didn't go out partying every weekend. Um, and that's just the truth. This person is about to pass away from alcohol poisoning. Alcohol poisoning. So excessive alcohol intake. So much so it's about to poison his body and cause a death. I heard cause death. So, I mean, this is serious, you guys. I think you guys know this masculine person. Okay, so I looked up the definition, Google definition of fraternity. A group of people associated or formally organized for a common purpose, interest, or pleasure, such as fraternal order, guild sense, a men's student organization formed chiefly for social purposes, having secret rights, and a name consisting of Greek letters. So fraternity, you know, they have the little Greek symbols with their fraternity, blase, blase, blase. Um, I don't know. That's why I think he's younger. I think he's in college. He's I think he's a college college age kid, and I'm calling him a kid because I'm 38 freaking years old. I think he's a college age freaking kid. I think I think he's anywhere from 17 or 18 to like 25 is my guess. I did not hear his age, but I'm guessing 17 or 18 to 25. Now he's probably younger than 21 i.e. the drinking age, just saying, just saying, um, but apparently he doesn't care, um, <laughs> um, but, um, 
It's about, I mean, he's a member of a uh, fraternal order. I heard it's going to shock the hell out of his community and cause a huge uproar in his community. So I think his community is his college and his fraternity and probably his family and hometown. I think he's currently in college right now and he's about to go to a keg room. Now, we're in summertime right now, so I don't know if he's currently enrolled in classes or if he's on break for summer. I didn't hear any of that, but he is a member of a fraternity. So um, I'm feeling he's anywhere from 17, 18 to 25. I, he, I think he goes to a, I think he goes to a party school. I, I'm serious. I'm not saying he's uh, going to a, this kegger with his fraternal brothers. I'm not saying that because we're in the middle of summertime. But he's going, about to go somewhere, because this hasn't happened yet. But we are 4th of July weekend, too. So it could be with his family. If they're a bunch of alcoholics, um, it could be with friends from hometown. I don't know. Um, let me see if I hear anything else. But I'm getting this for a reason. He's about to pass away, you guys. But it's about to cause a huge uproar. A huge uproar. A huge uproar. It's going to be huge. It's going to be huge. A huge rough roar and it's going to be huge. This is terrible. This is so terrible. Um, it hasn't happened yet. I would say my condolences, but it hasn't happened yet. But it's about to be because of the choices this young person is about to make. This young masculine energy. He loves alcohol and he loves to drink. I'll tell you that. He loves to party. I've never been one that, I mean, I'm a social drinker every now and then, but I don't even have friends because I'm an old woman. So, um, I don't know. Um, but he loves to drink, I'll tell you that. Concern. Number 33 can be very significant. Number one slide, number 33. There's about to be a public outcry when this death occurs. But he is about to take it too, 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 too far. There's about to be a public outcry when this death occurs, but he's about to take it too, 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 too far. So he's about to take one too many drinks. I heard alcohol poisoning. So he's about to drink so much, his body is not going to be able to process it all to where it's going to basically poison him from the inside out. Come on, baby, over here. Um, I'm serious. That's basically what alcohol, I mean, that's basically what alcohol poisoning is in a nutshell. Drinking so much to where your body cannot process it all, and it basically just poisons you from the inside. I heard there's going to be a huge, huge, huge outcry when this death occurs, but he's going to take it too far, meaning he's going to take one too many drinks. I'm feeling he might be under 21. I didn't hear how old he was, but I'm feeling he might be under the freaking legal drink drinking age. An air sign masculine is getting a huge wake-up call. An air sign masculine is getting a huge wake-up call. Uh, may, I don't know who you are, air sign masculine, but you're getting a huge wake-up call about something, sir. Um, hopefully you're high vibrational. Um, I don't know. This is terrible is what this is. And I'm just serious. Spirit messages you have to like this. Fear messages you have to put this. This death is going to devastate his father. Devastate him. But he did not get him any help in the past. He just supported, supported, supported. Okay, I heard this death is going to devastate his father, but he did not get him any help in the past. He just supported, supported, supported. So I'm assuming supported his drinking habit is what I'm presuming, or his partying habit, or it's involving a bunch shit ton of alcohol. I'm going to pull one more. I got Privileged Lady Upright. 
This is terrible. Spirit messages you have reflected. I heard it's going to devastate his father. Maybe his father's an air sign masculine or uh, any other sign. But I, it would devastate me if one of my children passed away that way. It'd devastate me if one of my children passed away, period. But especially that way because that's not how I raise my kids. Spirit messages you have reflected. Main female privileged lady. Number 12 or 2. Three very significant numbers in one's life. Message of concern. Upright. We have concern with message of concern. Number 12, 2, or 14 could be very significant numbers in one's life. These could be possible ages of children connected to this younger masculine energy. I didn't hear a sign on him that's about to pass away. Possibly. I mean, or any other significant number. 12, 2, 14. Maybe he has siblings is what I'm thinking. Maybe he has siblings. This is terrible. Um, he's in a fraternity. I think he's college age. Once this death occurs, it is going to go so public, so, so, so public. And it's going to drag up a lot of past, a lot, lot, lot of it. It's going to humiliate a family, wealthy family. Okay, I heard um, once this death goes public, it's going to um, it's going to go very, very, very public. And once it does, it's going to humiliate a very wealthy family. So I think this message of concern is message of concern of the death that's about to occur. And some kind of toxic path of this wealthy family or dealings of this wealthy family is what I'm presuming. Because I heard the past is going to be brought up in a huge freaking way. And... Um, Something to do with toxicity of this wealthy family, secrets of this wealthy family, some kind of dirty laundry they don't want aired out publicly, but it's about to be aired out. It is about to be aired out in a huge way once this death occurs. It's about to be aired out in a huge way once this death occurs. Message of concern. This family, toxic family, doesn't want it to get out, basically, but it's going to get out. Hold on one second, you guys. I'm sorry. Oh, my Lord. This is terrible. Sorry, that was my friend from California. <laughs> okay, so privileged lady, main female. It is going to cause the mother to stand up in a huge way. Ways people never thought she would. For not only her son, but a family of the past. Okay, I heard it's going to cause this mother to stand up in a huge way. Uh, it sounds like very publicly. Uh, for her son, it sounds like the son that's about to pass away and a family of the past. So I think this is you, Mother Energy. I think you I think you might watch my channel, Mother of This Son, that's about to pass away, ma'am. I think. I think. I'm not sure. But I'm pulling you in very strong. And you're coming up as privileged lady, upright, main female, upright. So um, I think you're, I heard you're about to stand up for, I mean, I think you, you're in some kind of very wealthy family, ma'am. Um, it doesn't sound like you're toxic. It sounds like your freaking family is. And I'm just being for real. It sounds like your family is, but it don't sound like you are. Um, but I heard it's going to, you're going to be like advocacy energy um, for your son or for the situation or for the to toxicity and toxic secrets of the past to be aired out publicly. And for a family of the past. Somehow a family of the past is connected into your toxic family. And yeah, but you're very wealthy. So I'm not sure why this family of the past is connected in. But somehow you're going to advocate, I think, for your um, the toxic secrets to be aired out in your toxic family. Um, your son's death and this family of the past. However that resonates, ma'am. I think this is your energy I'm pulling in. You're coming as a privileged lady upright, main female upright. I don't, I feel you're upright. I feel you're high vibrational. 
uh, you're obviously very wealthy, obviously. Um, and I think you, I think this is the mother energy here. I think you were the mother of this family. Um, Lord have mercy. This is terrible. We are 4th of July weekend though. So, I mean, oh, this is terrible. This is about to cause a lot of huge energy shifts. Huge, huge, huge energy shifts. This is about to cause a lot of huge energy shifts. Huge, huge, huge energy shifts. So um, when this death occurs, it's going to cause a lot of huge energy shifts. I think you're about to be a driving force in this energy shift. Uh, I feel high vibrational mother is what I'm feeling. Only you know if you're a high vibrational mother in this matriarchal type, very wealthy family or not, ma'am. Um... Only you know. What you're pulling up is the main female upright, privileged lady upright. Um, and so after this death occurs, um, I think you're the matriarch of this family. But I think you're going to cause huge energy shifts here, ma'am, if this resonates for you. This death has not occurred yet, but it sounds like it's upcoming. And we are 4th of July weekend, which is very, very, very heavy for, um, for drinking and driving and for drinking, period. And that's just the truth. Let me see if I hear anything else. You are going to stand up to your husband in a huge way. It's going to shock the hell out of him. You're going to become a new person after this occurs. Okay, I heard you're going to stand up to your husband in a huge way. Um, and you're you're going to become a new person after this death occurs. So after this uh, death occurs of your son, ma'am, it's going to basically give you a... a I'm not gonna, trying not to be crass, but I'm just being for real because y'all know I keep it real on here. Basically, a bitch life of reality. Basically, a bitch life of reality, and it's going to wake you up. And I heard it's going to basically cause you to become a new person. It's going to cause you to become a new person, and uh, you're going to stand up to your husband in a huge way. But honestly, I don't care if you. I've been single a long time, a long time. If I had a husband, which I don't think nobody want to be married, my ass, and that's okay because I don't want to be married, but. They would have to handle somebody standing up to them and talking and talking their viewpoint. So most, well, not most, but some men don't like that. They're very sexist. They do not like it when the woman, God forbid, has a voice. I don't know if you have been meek in the past or not stood up to him in the past or what. Y'all are very, very, very wealthy. So I think he has a very good job or you do or you both do. But however that resonates, it's about to be a huge shift. I think you're going to stay. I think you're going to stand up to him, is what I think. And I think it's going to shock the hell out of him. I think maybe you did not. And he might be sexist or he might not. Only you know if this man is sexist or not, ma'am. But um, it's going to cause a whole new you. Um, because, I mean, I can imagine losing a child. I could not imagine. And whoever this person is, this son, energy, he's young. He's young. He's in a fraternity. Um, this is terrible this is terrible i'm getting out of this man i'm getting out of this um good luck whoever this is for um good luck you guys good luck because this is um this is rough but i i i think it's gonna cause a uh, hurt is gonna cause a whole new you so it sounds like that's gonna be a good thing for you ma'am because i think it's going to bring you up into reality of how life really is i mean your son is about to make huge horrible choices here so much so he's about to kill himself in a bottle or bottles or a keg and um I, i'm not trying to be mean i'm just being serious some some th this is terrible 
By the way, this is psychic, intuitive, prophetic messages. One may apply, two may apply, two plus may apply, none may apply. Only you know your situation, or not anybody else. You have to plug message or messages in how they resonate. Um, I love you guys. This is really, really, really terrible. It really is, but I think it's about to give you a perspective change, ma'am, um, after this occurs. And it sounds like it's going to be a positive one for you. So um, good luck with this. Good luck. Love you guys. I'm going to say.